Hello, I'm Dr. Anil Goody, consultant in reproductive medicine. And today I'm going to talk to you about the role of aspirin in assisted conception. The question often asked is, does aspirin improve the chances of pregnancy in assisted conception? In fact, the first study that came out came out in 1997 where there was an indication that if you give aspirin, a low dose aspirin, in an IVF cycle, you may improve the chances of pregnancy. That was 1997. IVF has changed, embryology has changed, and our success rates have steadily increased. Is it still right to give aspirin or is it time to have a relook of whether low dose aspirin is useful or not? So let us look at the recent meta analysis which looked at 10 studies using aspirin, that is low dose aspirin, in assisted conception, that is IVF, and seeing whether the impact was better. Now, this paper is titled. Is aspirin effective in women undergoing IVF? And this was published in 2017. Ten studies were looked at. It concluded that low-dose aspirin does not improve pregnancy rates in IVF. It's also believed that by giving low-dose aspirin, you may improve the blood flow to the endometrium. And these studies also indicated that giving aspirin did not improve blood flow to the uterine vessels or to the endometrial vessels. Does aspirin lower the risk of preeclampsia? There seems to be some evidence there, but that is, does not mean that we need to give aspirin right from the day of embryo transfer. And what they concluded is use aspirin judiciously do not use it if it's not required there was one or two studies which suggested the negative aspect of aspirin but these were not many and the general talk way i would suggest is that avoid giving aspirin if it is not indicated in the IVF cycle. The evidence does not back it. Thank you very much.